the August Blooms and Quad Methodist Queen works own occasion. Or maybe Angelus Cow. Hi. Oh, seems to record her. Hey, everyone. So we are here at After Buzz TV and we are whispering because they are shooting in other uh, studios. studios. So we snuck into this empty one right here to do our intro. Uh, but we're very excited. We got asked to be guests uh, on the After Buzz TV show. We're going to have so much fun. It's just like a loose, like. Just enjoyable yeah. conversation. And I know that we're going to be chatting about the Pivot Principle, our upcoming summit. They told us we're going to be doing some games of how well we know each other. So I'm excited to check that out. Yeah, we'll be up in like five minutes. So come with us. So here's their little studio, and I, I basically want to like use this studio as inspiration to amp up the Fred and Alyssa show, because once we move, we're in a one bedroom apartment right now, we want to get like a two or three bedroom, and then turn one of the uh, apartment bedrooms into a studio. But we even saw this like outside, like we could do like a little like Fred and Alyssa show, like, what is this material called? All right, I'll find out, we'll have some cool to have that though. Yeah, we'll have to do like a little thing. This way when we have guests come on, we're gonna have a lot more guests in the friend list of show. We can have them like, I'll take pictures. Yeah. And I know you saw a little bit in here, but like, this is what we need to do. The step up. Yes, that's huge. Like, without just, the step. It, it sections the entire studio off. Cause this room isn't that big. Oh no, I think no. this room's like 150 to 200 square feet, if that. Yes. Then we gotta get a TV. Yes. Put that there. But yeah, they got they definitely have an inspirational setup here. Thanks for the inspo after buzz. Yeah, after buzz, <laughs> hooking it up. Hooking it up, baby. I even want to get that little red light outside the door just to turn it on because like So Benji doesn't fuck us. Yeah. We won't get our security deposit back, but just for us to have a red flashing light to seem professional, we'll do that in our new place. Great. Well now it's time. You guys have been guys. waiting for our guests today. We we told them earlier, we we tricked them because we were like, oh, we're gonna do our recap first, then we'll have our guests come in. And now we finally have Freddie and Alyssa joining us. Yay. Hi y'all. Hey, what's going on? Welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> Thank you for having That's us. Right. We're like, yes. we completely have been like going around your entire studio, just yeah, super impressed. Totally. <laughs> so awesome. Our own tour, really. Oh yeah, yeah, we kind of like- We made ourselves right at home. Yeah. <laughs> Because there was a moment where, like, we were sitting here and I was like, all right, we're starting segments, uh, the door's going to open any second, and, and I was like, they still not here. Where are they? <laughs> What's going on? But now it's a self-guided tour. Yeah. You guys have been super busy. Super busy. Um, first, let's talk about the book, um, which has been out for, for quite a bit now. About five months, yeah. Yeah. Um, the Pivot Principle. Um, for, tell us, first of all, what started the inspiration for this book? I think initially um, we talked about it because we, we were we've been like in entrepreneurship for like the past six years mm -hmm. and it wasn't something we ever intended on really doing. It's like yeah. we both came out here to be an actor, to be in the entertainment business, direct and write. And once we started getting into to like online sales and marketing and we're like, this is really awesome. Mm -hmm. And what, what comes with building businesses is learning how to communicate better, how to have better people skills. And when you put yourself out there, you start learning a lot of lessons uh, in business and in life that you can apply to different areas of your life. Yeah. And so we ended up getting into like coaching for years and yeah. we started gaining a lot of knowledge. And then we also had our own experiences in our life. We had some tragedies that went on mm -hmm. and we started accumulating all of these lessons mm -hmm. and we started sharing them with people. Yeah. And after we started having the positive feedback, we're like, we probably have enough stories and lessons to put this into a book. Mm -hmm. So we just wrote down a bunch of different stuff and it kind of started off as just like, let's just see what we can do. Yeah. And then over like a six month to a year period, it turned into a book mm -hmm. and all of a sudden we're like, we've got something <laughs> here. Do this. And yeah. we decided to self publish just as like a little side hustle and mm -hmm. put it out to the world, to friends, family, and uh, some of the, some of our following. And it just took off and yeah. we were like pleasantly surprised you always want it to do well right but then when it just was selling like crazy and then the positive feedback that people took the lessons we shared in the book mm -hmm. and applied them to their life and they wrote us like not like hey that was great but like a true <laughs> personal like personal stories. story and it yeah. meant the world to us that our stories and lessons in life um were able to impact people
and it's just I like it. Well, um, since you guys are always uh, very uh, open and honest uh, with what's happening with you and putting yourselves out there, you know we here like to play little games. <laughs> So we were gonna play one. If you look down by you, there are dry erase boards and hopefully there's still uh, markers and things like yeah. that. There are. So we are gonna play a little game of how, how well do you know each other? Uh -oh. So we are going to, we each are gonna ask <laughs> a <nervous>. question. <laughs> She's sweating. <laughs> that can't be your nerves. Yeah, that can't right here. Um, so uh, Freddie will ask you a question uh, about Alyssa. You will write down what you think she's gonna say. Alyssa, you write down the correct answer and we're gonna see Got how it. well you know each other. All right? right. Let's do it. Here we go. <laughs> okay, so first question, Freddie. What is Alyssa's favorite comfort food? You gotta like it. Okay. okay all right. You, you guys have. Wait, wait, wait. wait. So, Freddie, show us your answer. He said pizza. Mm. Oh, Alyssa. I said pizza. Oh! <laughs> but she has this this superpower that she'll be full after a slice. Oh, and then no. she's like, oh, I got this medium pizza. And I'm like, well, there's only one slice missing, and then I guess I'll have the rest. <laughs> if I'm doing a cheat meal, it's got to be like a, like a, like a burger, yeah. and then once it's gone, it's over. A yeah. pizza is the worst it's because there's just way too much of uh -huh. it, and she has like one slice. So I'm very well, worried about that. Well, I tell them I save it for later, you know? You can't I save it for later. I might as well just finish it and get the job done, you know? I like cold pizza, too. It's really good. Yeah, oh. the Jello Ranch. So Alyssa. Yeah. What is Freddie's favorite genre of TV and film? Oh. Okay. Uh oh. I'm thinking TV. When you said TV. Okay. 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 That's a little hint for you, Freddie. It is a hint. <laughs> um, Freddie, there's no pressure here. It's your answer. You can. Just I know. <laughs> I'm gonna do TV and film here. <laughs> oh no. He's gonna, he's gonna put, he's gonna put two I'll throw it back at you. All right. All right. I hope I'm right. I said reality. Oh. We watch a lot of reality at our household. Mm -hmm. So just remember that when you were answering. <laughs> <laughs> what, what would you think I was going to do for film? Drama? Or action. Action. I'm sorry. Action. For okay. sure. Oh, I just missed no, it right there. Uh -huh. but I did get your first reality. Oh, reality and, and comedy. comedy. I was going to say comedy. I didn't know. You're always. Because he likes doing these action movies, and I'll sometimes watch them, but I'll be like, watch it on your own. We'll <laughs> <laughs> do comedies together, you know? Oh my God. Thank you guys so much for Thank coming you in. Guys. Oh, I appreciate it. So So much fun. It was really cool being in the being in the hot seat yeah. and uh, uh, just great people. Amazing people. We had so much fun. It went by so fast. We're gonna have them on our show in October once we just ripped off like literally like five ideas from their whole studio. <laughs> so you're probably gonna recognize a lot of the stuff that we're gonna do. But it's raining, so yes. we're gonna run to the car right now and uh, and keep trying. So thank okay. you all for watching. We'll see you later. <laughs> <laughs>